Hey, good morning. Welcome back. Busy day here at Storm Team 10. We have uh, the possibility of some strong morning thunderstorms alongside a wind advisory that has been issued leading to very strong winds this afternoon, and we are going to continue to be warmer than normal. So all these major impacts today, if you need to do anything outside, you need to plan around each and every one of these. And, you know, of course, we do have some light rain now. These are not what I'm talking about. This is the first round of scattered showers, maybe some moderate rain that you might be dealing with. You can see the primary line is right here from Charleston Mattoon area all the way down to Vincennes. But you can see how scattered and light some of this rain is. Crawford County, Robinson area, you have some of this moderate rain. And I wouldn't rule out maybe every once in a while a rumble of thunder. Maybe you'll see a flash of lightning. But we are going to see stronger thunderstorms in the next couple of hours. And you can see them already starting to develop out here in central Illinois. And these are going to pass through here pretty quick, providing us potentially with stronger wind. And even outside of thunderstorms, we could see wind gusts up to 45 50 miles an hour. So this is going to be a very windy day. You can see a wind advisory until this evening has been issued for the entire region. This goes into effect this morning, continues again through about 7 p.m. this evening. And our temperatures, you know, we're in the lower 50s now. We have these strong winds coming in out of a warmer place. Temperatures are going to bounce back to the lower 60s at their highest. And, you know, we're already almost there in Florida to the southwest. Lower 50s here at Terre Haute and even now, Temperatures are way warmer than they typically are this early in the morning, even in late February. So if you need to do anything outdoors, it feels nice, feels comfortable. But again, you're working around rain and you can see our future cast showing around seven. We're still dealing with this light scattered rain this first round. But you can see what's about to happen here over here to the west, getting organized, some heavier rain. This swings through here very quick. So this is around 8 a.m. This line of thunderstorms continues to pass through here. Could be strong. We could see some stronger winds associated with this, some thunder, lightning. You can see where the heavier rain is on the future cast anyway. KZ, Marshall area, Clark County, Edgar County, Paris area, same situation. This moves through here pretty fast. So this is around 9 a.m. already trying to leave here. And, you know, we could continue to see some stronger wind. The heavier rains uh, is still there. And you can see even as this leaves, we have these scattered light rain showers staying behind into mid-morning. This is around 10 a.m., some scattered light rain, maybe some heavier rain in some spots. You can see south of Brazil there, Clay County. We have sunlight trying to take over. So around mid morning here, this is 11 lunchtime, start of the afternoon. Cloud cover returns, but briefly there this morning, we could see some sunlight. But for the most part, we're going to start to dry up and we are going to be very windy for the rest of the day. With temperatures in the lower 60s at the highest this afternoon, the winds take over. You can see the cloud cover returns. And it is going to be very windy, wind gust 45, 50 miles an hour. Watch loose objects outside. Make sure the trash can's taken care of, yard decorations. And if you have to work outside, just plan around strong winds even after these thunderstorms leave. Temperatures lower 60s. It's going to happen midday. All throughout the afternoon, early evening, we're going to cool down. We're going to be around 40 tonight. Temperatures are going to bounce back a little bit tomorrow. It's a little cooler throughout the day. Still warmer than normal, though. Mid-50s isn't too bad for the end of February. We're going to see clouds leave throughout the day tomorrow with sunlight taking over. And you can see on our seven-day forecast, look at Wednesday. Way, way warmer than normal. Upper 60s, mostly sunny. A very nice day to be outside with near record-high temperatures.